from edible eyeballs and foul-smelling fish to tasty tarantulas and scrumptious scorpions. Here are 20, 20 unusual foods from around the world. Hey guys, how's it going? This is your host, American Eye, bringing to you another epic video. But before we get started, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and hit that bell for notifications. Number 20, the Beyondagi. From Korean, that word means pupa, as in a stage of life that insects enter as they mature. For this treat, the pupae silkworms are steamed or boiled as a snack food and sold on the street by vendors. They're also prepared in other countries, including Japan and India. Depending on the location, the silkworms are prepared with sweet and sour sauce or with herbs and chili pepper. Served plain, Beyondegi is said to have a nutty fishy taste. Number 19. Fugu How would you like a meal that contains enough toxin to take down 30 humans? Fugu is a type of puffer fish that is renowned for being both delectable and deadly. Its poison is called tetrodotoxin, which is about 1200 times more powerful than cyanide and has no known antidote. Needless to say, that this fish must be meticulously prepared before it's suitable for human consumption. As a result, fugu chefs must undergo rigorous apprenticeship before earning a license to prepare and sell this dish. Number 18. Stargazy Pie in Cornwall, you can order a dish with ingredients that are gazing skyward. Stargazy pie gets its name for the sardine heads that poke through the pastry crust. Along with the fish's entire body, ingredients include eggs and potatoes. The fishy food is traditionally eaten during Tom Bawcock's Eve. That's a festival celebrating an epic fish catch that occurred during a harsh winter. It's said that all the fish were baked into an enormous stargazy pie, which kept the Cornish village from starving. Number 17. Amazing Spider Snacks there are more than a thousand species of huntsman spider out there. On average, they can attain a leg span of around 6 inches or 15 centimeters and are found in temperate and tropical climates. In Venezuela and Indonesia, they're a very popular food. But we couldn't find out exactly what these arachnids taste like. We're assuming it's something along the lines of chicken? If you know what they taste like, let us know in the comments below. Number 16. Gateway Bugs because mealworms are often the first insects people try to eat, it's affectionately referred to as the gateway bug. They're popular due to having a great nutritional profile, being easy to raise, and tasting like roasted nuts. You can even buy containers of the insects in bulk and already pre-mixed with bran or oatmeal. Did you know that they're actually not worms at all? They're the larvae of the darkling beetle, a small, flightless, non-biting insect. Number 15. Bird's Nest Soup in Chinese culture, this is a delicacy made from an edible bird's nest. Such a nest is created by small birds called swiftlets who use their saliva which dries and hardens. Once constructed, the nests are prized for their rarity and exquisite flavor. Upon being dissolved in water, the nest takes a gelatinous, rubbery texture. The savory and sweet dish has been prepared in China for hundreds of years now. Thanks to their scarceness, there are a number of varieties that come with a steep price tag. A kilogram, or 2.2 pounds, of red nest variety can cost as much as 10,000 US dollars, making them one of the most expensive foods of the world. Number 14. Escamole Ant larvae that have been harvested from the root of the agave plant are sometimes referred to as insect caviar. The white shapes might look like rice, but they're actually huge eggs of ants. They're said to have a similar texture to cottage cheese and a taste that's described as nutty and buttery. It's considered a delicacy in Mexico, where it's been served up since the time of the Aztecs. Number 13. Surströmming Originated in Sweden, here's a food that not only sounds fishy, but smells that way too. Understandable, given that it's a type of herring from the Baltic Sea that's been heavily fermented. But it's given just the right amount of salt to ward off decomposition. Still, this food is often referred to as rotten fish. And it certainly earns that title. A Japanese study concluded that a newly opened can of surströmming contained the foulest stench of any food on earth. Suffice to say, this one is definitely an acquired taste and smell. Number 12. Haggis This Scottish food has to be one of the more recognizable names on this list. It's a dish that owes a lot to sheep. The animal not only contributes its lungs, heart, and liver, but also its bladder, which is used to encase the ingredients. After being combined with spices, onion, and salt, it's mixed with stock to produce a savory pudding. According to connoisseurs, it has a nutty texture with a delectable flavor. Did you know that haggis is also made in the US? Due to a ban on sheep lung, it can't be exported there. So it has to be made by Scottish companies that adhere to the tradition. But sheep lung isn't used, and the casing is actually artificial. Number 11. Kui 
Most of us think of guinea pigs as cute furry pets, but in some parts of the world, the humble little rodent is considered to be some good protein. In South America, they've been breeding the critters for a long time for their meat. Indigenous people of the Andean highlands consider the koi, or guinea pig, to be a delicacy reserved for special occasions. In Peru alone, it's estimated that over 65 million guinea pigs are killed each year for their meat. Number 10. Southern Fried Snake in the southern states of the U.S., rattlesnakes can be served as a delicacy, hence the title. The meat is often boiled off the bones, then rolled in flour, breadcrumbs, and seasoning before being deep fried. According to those who have eaten it, the snake is supposed to taste like frog's legs, and those are said to taste like chicken and fish. In fact, rattlesnake is sometimes called the desert white fish of American Southwest. Number 9. Witchetty Grubs these insects are primarily the wood-eating larvae of cosset moss in Australia. They survive on the roots of the witchetty bush, hence their common name. Historically, the grubs have been a major staple in the diets of Aboriginal Australians and is considered to be the most vital insect food of the desert. Whether eaten raw or cooked lightly, the grubs provide a high source of protein and fat content. Served raw, they kind of taste like almonds. When cooked, the skin becomes crisp, not unlike roast chicken. What a surprise! Number 8. How Cut did you know the national dish of Iceland is a fermented Greenland shark that has been cured and fermented for up to five months? Because it contains large amounts of ammonia, it has a pungent smell like many cleaning products. In fact, the food smell is actually far stronger than the taste. So first timers are advised to pinch their nose when initially eating Hakarl. And how is it taste? Well, some expert chefs describe it as, quote, the single worst, most disgusting and terrible tasting thing ever. Number seven, the century egg. This food is made in China, but it doesn't take 100 years to prepare. The name comes from the practice of preserving duck, chicken, or quail eggs in a mix of ash, salt, clay, quicklime, and rice hulls. Depending on the process used, the eggs can take several months to cure. That procedure can result in an off-putting appearance, but the yolk's taste is said to resemble a ripe, pungent camembert cheese. Number 6. Cockroach Cuisine if you're going to snack on these ubiquitous bugs, don't go scooping up the ones around your house. The roaches considered the safest to eat are those who are fed a diet of salad and fresh fruit. Those specimens are considered healthy and very tasty too. It's said that the Madagascar hissing cockroach actually tastes like a helping of greasy meat. Number 5. Tuna Eyeballs This popular food is found in Japanese supermarkets selling for less than a dollar. If you don't like the idea of your food watching you while you eat it, maybe this isn't the best option. But it seems to be simple enough to prepare. Just boil the season of the fish orbs before eating, and you'll experience a taste that's kind of like squid. Like they say, the eyes have it. Number 4. Balut This particular food is commonly sold in street markets of the Philippines where it originated. It's also sold in Laos, Vietnam, and other countries in Southeast Asia. Balut is basically a developing bird embryo, most often duck or chicken. It's boiled and eaten from the shell and often served with beer. The overall look of balut can be sobering for those unfamiliar with it. And some diners might balk over digging into such unusual egg. Outside of Southeast Asia, it's often viewed as a novelty food and presented mainly for its shock value. Number 3. Sanakuji In Korea, long arm octopus is considered a delicacy. Before being killed, the critter is seasoned, then plated. Then it's often served up to you quite raw and still alive. The cephalopod has a complex nervous system which causes the tentacles to twitch and spasm even without any brain activity. That means your meal can pose a health hazard even though it's dead. Because its suckers are still active, they can adhere to your throat while it's being swallowed. It is still considered a health food, but it's been the mainstay of Korean cuisine for ages. Number 2. Scary Scorpion Snack Foods would you have the intestinal fortitude to munch on this creature? Many varieties are often sold fried and skewered on sticks in the night markets of various cities in China. And the larger black arachnids command a hefty price, enough to put a sting on your wallet. It could be worth it though. The scary looking critters are said to have a taste similar to shrimp with a nut-like edge. And number 1. Toasted Tarantulas If you have an appetite for these arachnids, the Thai zebra spider might be the food for you but you have to go to Cambodia to find it. That's where you can be served a dish known as a ping as it's known in the Khmer language. It's basically a heaping of fried tarantula. They're a real tourist attraction given that the spiders grow up the size of a human palm. 
While that encourages more visitors to take photos, some of the brasher types will accept the challenge to feast on the tarantulas. They're usually prepared with sugar, salt, MSG, and garlic. Even with all that seasoning, they're said to taste like chicken. Doesn't everything? Whoa, now that was a cool video. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.